I've just arrived at the quaint harbor village of Bak Meng. Now this is one of the main ports of call for people visiting Thong because from here it is easy to get to all the surrounding islands. Now the best thing to do is contact a tour group because if you have a group going with you it will be more convenient and your price will be cheaper. Now today I'm going to go on a snorkeling trip to four of the most beautiful islands in this area. Got Chuk and Got Ma have beautiful coral formations and Got Kadan and Got Muk have natural cave formations. So come with me today on my snorkeling trip. Now we're about to start a one hour boat tour. This boat is called Payun, which means walrus in Thai. Now this tour takes approximately one hour and our first stop is the Emerald Cave. Now this trip is safe fun for the whole family because everyone is required to wear the necessary safety equipment and I'm told that even people who can't swim can have a wonderful time on this trip because the water is clear and not that deep and of course everyone has to wear life jackets. So enjoy this trip with me. All right, now I'm all suited up and ready to go. Got my life jacket, my goggles, my snorkel. Actually, I was gonna enter the water from the second floor here, but they told me that wasn't safe. So I actually have to wait to go down to the first floor of the boat. But we're actually here now. We're right off the shores of the island, Kokodan. So in a few minutes, we'll be heading in the water. So just wait a second. All right. Well, we've just anchored off the shores of Kokodan and already I can see an abundance of marine life. There's lots of beautiful fish. Now, I'm told that the waters in this area are only about two meters deep, which is pretty shallow. So life vests are optional, but I've decided to wear mine for safety reasons and because we've got a long day ahead of us and I don't want to expend any unnecessary energy. Alright, now it's time to feed the fish. Now, the fish in this area live in a protected area. So they're used to people being around, swimming and feeding them. So they're not scared at all. Now behind me is the second location of our boat trip, which is called Gop Muk. Now in Thai, Gop Muk means Pearl Island. And within this island is a very special cave, which they call the Emerald Cave. Now come with me as we go exploring. Behind me is the entrance to Tam Malakot, or the Emerald Cave. Now, this cave entrance is only accessible by the water and only during times of the low tide. During the high tide, you have to actually scuba dive into the cave. So this is the perfect time for us to go in. So follow me. All right, it's now time to explore the mysterious wonders of the Emerald Cave. So, follow me in here, and hopefully we can get some light. Now around the corner, you see some sunlight penetrating. Now you might think it's the exit of the cave, but actually it's a beach which is located inside the cave. Let's go take a look. So what we actually thought was the exit of the cave is actually an entrance to a secluded beach which is located in the middle of the island. It's only accessible by water. Now if you notice above, this cave comes out into an opening which is kind of an open bottleneck in the middle of the island. Now I guess technically this beach could be accessible by the air but I wouldn't try it. 
I think coming in by the cave is the best bet. We've just arrived at Kok Chue, which is another one of the beautiful islands located off the coast of Krang. Now, just looking down, I see an abundance of fish. And I've been told that the coral underneath these waters are much more beautiful and colorful than some of the other islands around this area. So let's go take a look. We're now almost at the last leg of our one-day excursion, which is the island of Kaup Ma, which is behind me right here, right now. Now, supposedly, the coral formations next to this island are beautiful as well, but different from the other islands around here. So, let's go down and check it out. That there's some very beautiful, colorful assortment of coral formations next to this island, which is Kaup Ma. So I'm going to go take a look and I'll tell you how beautiful it is. 